encompasses the whole organization and all people, joining them up where they used to be very much on their own. Finally, do I have one more minute, Andy, or am I? Four minutes. Four. Oh, oh. <laughs> um, we always see these inspirational people when we go to different conferences, especially I have internally in my mind, I have a little gamble. I say, how many Martin Luther Kings do I see today? Because they are the people that inspire us. And of course they do. Um, when I started up, I said, everybody can be a leader. And it's been said before today, you have to be upwards, sideways, downwards, in many directions. And when we hear about Martin Luther King, we go, oh, well, that's, a, that's a big pair of shoes to fill. But what I've been highly inspired about is this woman. Do you know who she is? Giles? <laughs> Rosa Parks? She's the lady who wouldn't move in the bus in Montgomery when she was asked to. The, the interesting thing about reading up on the story, it, it wasn't she sat in a white man's seat. She sat in a section for black people. When the white people came on board, they moved the rows back. And she had been at work today, and what she said was she was very tired. Not tired from work, but she was tired of moving, and that's why she kept sitting there. She didn't have a lot of brass on her shoulder. She wasn't a big leader in the common sense. She was an average person who just had enough. She wanted things to change. And I think the same thing goes for you when you go back to the office. If you want to do innovation, if you want to change things, be like her. Say, I'll do it now. And you do it by being emotionally intelligent. Know what triggers you, what motivates you, and how you can use it. So, I think you could go back and use that, and, and for me it's a little prayer to you all. I, I've worked in the non-profit industry, the non-government industry, for a long, long time, and I'm tired of being a non, or a not. <laughs> I would love to be a for or something, a for change, <laughs> to be people who want to change the world. So please, if you could help me out with that for next year when we meet up, that would be a brilliant thing. So, please go out there.